Okay. Okay. Okay, we're here. Yep. Okay. We are here. Yeah. So. <laughs> hey, everybody. My name is Andrew. And I'm Greg. And we are here with MainsPlayingCards.com. Greg has not been in the last few videos. Matthew Williams has been kind of filming and stepping in and kind of helping me with a lot of projects. So thank you to Matthew Williams. But a lot of people have been asking, where's Greg been? So where has Greg been? Um, well, unfortunately, uh, I had a death in the family. My mom actually passed away. Uh, she was pretty well that person that would just give anybody anything that she had, basically, that type of person. So I'm sort of glad that we're doing this giveaway for them to be a cool little... Yeah, and we are definitely doing this as a tribute to Greg's mom. So I was like that, that spirit of like giving to people and kind of giving back to the community, too. And today, what are we doing today? A, sort of a surprise for a friend of ours. Uh, he's sort of our first fan. We met this guy named Abbas in Nepal, and mm -hmm. what we're gonna do is we are um, building him the perfect brick to give to him as it is very hard for him to get real cards in Nepal. Um, I, he is a phenomenal cardist. He started to put out some videos recently that kind of caught our attention. Cool. The first thing I asked him was like, what's he currently using as far as playing cards? And his reply was, he mainly uses paper cards, and I wasn't really sure what that meant. <laughs> and except when he wants to do springs, he uses plastic cards. It's like, I'm in awe. I'm yeah. In awe. I'm <laughs> yeah. like, really? <sighs> yeah, we were <sighs> like, what? <laughs> so. So he's never used anything by a United States playing card company. He's never used anything like that at all. So he, we are going to build him a small little collection brick to get him started. And we are also giving away an entire brick of our playing cards yeah. to him. And the ones that you give him, like, so jealous, dude. I am so jealous. I'm jealous of the decks I'm giving away, too. <laughs> Let's get into what we are giving him. Since okay. Oh, we gotta go with the traditional bicycle. Everybody has used these. Some people swear by them. But it's definitely one that I have purchased more than any other deck. Be including a blue one in there as well for him. Oh, awesome. Next one. Monarchs. So a standard of something that's just a little better. They're Monarchs by Theory 11. This is just the standard blue with the red seal Monarchs. And those will be in there as well. Oh, there we go. Okay. <laughs> so this is another one by Theory 11. Um, besides the Monarchs, the Monarchs tend to be their standards they always have. This is one that they've put out more recently that's caught our eye. Contrabands used to be my favorite by Theory 11, and I think these have taken that place. So this is Provisions by Theory 11. <laughs> Next up is um, a deck by Illusionist. It is the LTD Purples. Just something from Illusionist. You should definitely have an Illusionist deck in your collection. Glassbacks. Glassbacks. Yeah. Why this is this here? We all have decks from friends of ours. I bought these from a guy, from the guy who made them, Simon Bruno. I met him at Cardistry Con in 2015, and I really like them. So you should always have somebody who you know, like one of their decks. So. Right, Cardistry Con. Cardistry Con, and those Berlin, are the Berlin, Berlin 2016s. Yep. So that is a convention, convention deck. deck. Yep. Gotta have one of those. Everybody has to have a convention deck, convention and that is like deck. top. I I use those. I use those a lot. Me too. <laughs> Do you have some of those? I don't. You don't? Oh, I know. I'm like, okay. I'm so jealous. I'm okay. Like, no, well, while the no. camera's rolling. Okay. <laughs> oh, you give me one. Somebody's calling me on Facebook. Yeah. Okay, these are for you, Greg. So, you do have those now. Perfect. <laughs> okay. The next one, this is my personal favorite deck of playing cards, but you have to have something by Dan and Dave. This is the V7 Carbons. And just a reminder, this is the stock and finish that we're getting on our playing cards. Yeah, Dan and Dave, you can't go wrong with anything Dan and Dave. So, Abyss, these are coming your way. Virtuosos. Yes. Virtuosos. The yellow ones, these are the ones where they did liquid paper. The video liquid paper. Yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, so Abyss, we're expecting that from this deck. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's what we're expecting the whole time. He, yeah. he actually emailed me and was like, what kind of video do you guys want me to make? And I'm like, I just want you to make a good one. You know? like, I want you <laughs> to have fun, one. you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come up with him. He's a nice guy. Okay, so the next deck would be Orbits. You should definitely have Orbits. This is the 7th edition, the newest ones. He was talking about those. He's like, those look so cool. Uh, like, they do look cool, don't they? <laughs> they do look cool. Yeah. Um, mm. and, and an interesting thing, these are marked. A lot of people don't know that. Really? This edition is marked. 
Yeah. Ooh. Love <laughs> Orbits. The jam videos they put out are top notch. First. From Chris Ramsey. I don't even have these either. I don't have a lot of these. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to go back and get you one. <laughs> not on this one, sorry. And this, let me know how these are. Definitely let me know how these Everybody are. Everybody should have a Chris Ramsey deck. Yeah, yeah, of course. And then, of course, Fontaine's. Yes. Uh, we, we couldn't leave Fontaine's <clears throat> off. Zach Mueller has made a huge dent in the Cardistry community and in that movement. Um, and these are it's the blue dent, right? editions. Dent? You mean crater? You mean yeah, he's made a crater. crater. He, yeah, I think we have some great stuff. Though. Then we have Dan and Dave. Anyway. <laughs> I know, I know you were hesitant on giving this one away. You were very, but it has to go. I love Dan and Dave things. I love all things Dan and Dave. And the only two anyone decks I have are the two Dan and Dave anyone, and I believe that's the Smoke Edition. Abyss, I'm giving you one of my anyone Dan and Dave <laughs> cards that I really be okay. <laughs> don't want to part okay. with, but I know that like you deserve these Abyss. There you go. You deserve this. And that is it. <laughs> that that's yeah. like the ultimate or perfect like cardistry break good for somebody break. who's never like who's never had anything by USPCC. This is a good box of stuff to dig deeper into like doing things, especially you have more cards this spring for sure. And besides just sending a brick of some of our favorite decks of playing cards, we're also sending Abyss a brick of our playing cards. Yes, our yes. playing cards that are coming out towards the end of March that we're getting really, really soon that we've been talking about nonstop. Abyss will be getting a brick of those as well. And then we're also going to throw in some more playing cards. We're going to throw in a hat in there. So it's very expensive to send things to Nepal. And that was kind of part of the reason why it's hard for him to get decks. So I'm sending this package to Nepal, and we have to wait about a month to get our playing cards in. So if anybody out there would like anything included in this package, if you have a deck you would like to donate to him, um, please send us a message and we might be able to get that included in this as well. The goal here would be to like really give Abyss some a cards to, yeah, give him a shot to really to show, show off with and show. really start a community with maybe a, in Nepal, right? Yeah. Because we might go to Nepal. It could happen. You never know. It we'll could happen. It goes. Yeah. You never know. You never know. All right. I think that's it, everybody. Right? Is that so. it? Yep. And that is it.